Can I fix her? Yes, the fuck I can. Seriously, I think fixing Nicole from Class of 09 is possible and highly rewarding. Now, if you don't know already, Class of 09 is a peak anime about a sociopathic girl, Nicole, and her senior year. Nicole and her friend Jekka are mean girls who manipulate people and do drugs while skipping class. I already made a pretty good video on Class of 09, go watch it. I timestamped the parts explaining what the game is in more detail. Now, I can continue. Yes, as the title implies in the thumbnail, I do believe I can indeed fix her. Really, all it takes is some rehab and some time. As a great monk somewhere in some Asian mountain range once said, Things take time. Nicole, like all people, has an occasional reflection of her poor decisions. I feel as if this could awaken her mind to realize that her life is messed up. Now, obviously, the best way to help someone who's depressed and has a drug problem is to give them support. Start to slowly phase out the drug usage. Outright getting rid of the drugs would cause rebellious activity and would cause poor coping mechanisms. Behind all sociopaths is suppressed emotions, or something like that, I'm not a psychologist. So slowly learning out the suppressed might work. This process would take many months, and maybe even years, but over a period of time, you can fix anyone. Nicole is no exception to this. She grew up bad, and thus has bad habits. However, I may run into a big issue because of her misandry and her resistance to authority. Now, I have a really simple solution to this, however, major issues have arisen because my world-famous lobotomies in recent times have been getting hard backlash, leading to the Medical Board of California revoking my practicing license. This means I have to go to Plan C. Plan C requires two females, one punk, one like Jekka, and $20,000. Now you might be thinking, is this dude on drugs? And yes, while I'm writing the script, I am, but that's besides the point. Since Nicole doesn't respect men, trying to change her directly would be futile. The best course of option is to pay two girls to be her friend, and they'll slowly shift her towards the light as part of the agreement. Assuming everything goes to plan, this should be the final step. And here we are, folks. The end result is someone completely fucking different. That's right, Nicole is a solid 10 out of 10, and her personality definitely needs some tweaking, but at some point, when you start removing certain imperfections in a person, the personality goes with it. I don't need to fix her. She's already perfect. Nicole's personality may be toxic, but really think about it. Is that a bad thing? I mean, growing up, we're always told to be ourselves. That is unless you're in a redneck area. Nicole just wants to be herself. Nicole struggles interacting with people correctly, but luckily she found Jekka, and likely because they are very similar, they clicked instantly. But society would deem this bad, and they would override the be yourself idea. Being yourself only applies to normal motherfuckers, the kind of people who consume mainstream media, the type of people who have bland and boring personalities, the type of people who aren't very intelligent and just blindly follow orders from higher-ups. As the chuds would say, sheeple. And really, isn't it kind of fucked up to think someone's wrong for being themselves? Why the fuck would I want to conform to a society which despises me? Why can't we just accept people for who they are? Sure, Nicole on the outside seems really fucked up, but you never know what's on the inside. As a wise schizo poster once said, she doesn't need fixing, she's already perfect. This video is short because I am working on my longest video yet. Next up, Cursed Anime Review 14, Class of 09, The Re-Up.